Welcome to my channel and thank you for taking the time to watch this video. I would also like to welcome Spirit into this reading and say thank you for the messages we are about to receive. This is a general reading. Okay, so the first card is the Justice card. So you could be dealing with some kind of legal situation. There is the woman of the world over here. So you are quite knowledgeable about what is going on. Uh, you could be, um, you know, dealing with this person, uh, a female, uh, who is going to give you some kind of advice on how to deal with this legal situation that you're uh, going through. Or this could be, well, you know, it could be you dealing with the situation, looking to the past for answers uh, to be able to sort through whatever legal problems you're going through. There's somebody around you that is very, very supportive, a very, very f um, good friend, uh, somebody um, yeah, helping you through this particular situation that you're going through. Now, in the past, you've got the wealth card, so some kind of money has come in for you, uh, but you've gone through a heartbreak situation, so you've been crying quite a bit. Uh, there might have been a loss of a relationship. There was some kind of payout that you got. Uh, you know, there was some kind of breakup, but it's caused a lot of um, pain on your part. Now, going into the future, there's a scandal card over here. So, um, you know, something coming to light that causes a bit of uh, chaos. So there's some kind of information that's going to cause tongues to wag, if you like, that you're going through. Whatever this legal situation is, causes a bit of a scandal there. Um, there's a need for forgiveness. Now, it's either forgiveness on your part of somebody or uh, forgiving an old situation in order for you to move on. So there's some kind of forgiveness that needs to be done in order for you to move on. Maybe there's a lot of regret and upset going on. You need to forgive the situation in order for you to move on. So those are the energies for that week. Now I'm going to use the uh, pagan, oops, the pagan ways tarot for the main read. I have shuffled this deck, and I have put it in the description box. So have a look. It's a very, very beautiful deck. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, you've got the two of wands, and this is you trying to take control of that situation. You're leaving something behind, and you are trying to manifest a new future over there. So there you are at a crossroads in your life at this particular moment, and you're letting go of that past and making plans and trying to make things move for the future. So if you've got that Dominion card, it's akin to the um, Magician card. So you are trying to use everything in your power to manifest something new. So this could be uh, a new situation that you're trying to manifest, a new opportunity that you're trying to fest, manifest, but you are focusing all your intention and will on this particular uh, manifestation. So you've got the Three of Wands over here, a new opportunity being offered to you right now, and you are considering it very, very carefully. It's something that promises a lot of abundance. You've got a lot of greenery over here and a lot of growth. There are some people that you're relying on for some kind of advice as well. There might be three friends, uh, and you are making plans for the future. So you are strategizing and making plans for the future. Whatever situation you went through, uh, there was a lot of financial loss that came with it and you've been feeling very very tied very restricted uh you know money has been tight it's been a very toxic situation you've got a lot of snakes on the ground over here so there are people around you that caused financial loss for you and have uh, you know maybe the friends that you thought were true friends are not really true friends and they have all abandoned you and made you feel really left out in the cold uh you know very very unsupported as well You've got the Seven of Cups in the past over here, so there were a lot of options available for you. You know, you've got some some options were not really good, very, very toxic, uh, um, you know, uh, opportunities really coming for you that, you know, uh, you have a lot of things in your mind that you want to do, uh, but you're not quite sure. So you've been going in the past, uh, going through a state of confusion in the past year. You've got this full moon over here. So there have been a lot of toxic people, maybe, uh, maybe deceptive people that you've also been dealing with as well, making promises to you and not fulfilling these promises. There is some kind of legal decision pending and it's been going on in the last um, 
three months, maybe the decision has already been made or maybe you're waiting for a legal decision to be made as well. Maybe whatever legal decision didn't go in your favor as well because you've got that five of pentacles. So maybe there was a loss because of that legal decision. You were waiting for something. Maybe you felt that, you know, whatever you invested in a situation did not pay off. So you didn't get whatever you wanted. Maybe there was supposed to have been some uh, some kind of payoff that was supposed to have come through for you but didn't come through. Uh, you've got this cultivation card of yours. So you have been patiently waiting for things to come your way, but maybe it did not go your way because you've got that financial loss card going on over there. So whatever you invested in the situation, whatever the outcome was, was not very financially favorable. Now, you, it looks like you have been going through a legal battle over there. Uh, you've been asked, getting some kind of legal advice because you've got that Four of Swords over there. So news about that coming in for you. There's a truce being call, called over here. So maybe an apology coming in for you as well after going through a, a difficult legal situation. Uh, and you are getting some kind of advice. You are taking a break from the situation in a sense. And you are, you know, looking uh, for a new strategy. It looks like whatever that situ situation is, you might be the one that is the winner because you've got this bird carrying the snake over here. So it looks like you, know, you are dealing with toxic people, but you are going to be the one that overcomes in that particular situation. So what's going on with you? You're on, um, you've got the eight of uh, pentacles going on for you. So you are focusing a lot on your work. There's a lot of uh, learning and education going on with your work. You might be doing training as well uh, in the job, but there's money coming in uh, for you with this eight of pentacles. You've got the two of pentacles over here, and this is weighing your financial options. So, you know, whatever job you may have been dealing with in the past, there was a lot of drama. There's been a lot of drama around money yeah, you've got this pentacles on fire over here. So you're trying to refocus, reprioritize, uh, and you're trying to uh, come up with ideas on how to raise more money over here. You might be starting from scratch again because you've got this pentacle on the ground. So starting from the ground up again, you've got the skeleton or the skull of an, uh, a cow here that shows you know a lot of financial loss has been incurred by you. So you are going through a very, very difficult financial period and it has got all it's all got to do with this legal situation that you've been involved in. You feel very, very defeated, very, very disempowered by whatever has happened. There's been a lot of drama, a lot of tower moments going on over here, a lot of bad luck, it seems. You know, the sky is very, very gray over here. So you're going through a very, very a difficult period and you're feeling very, very defeated in this particular uh, situation. So going into the future, you've got the depression, oppression, and the tower. So this, these are really devastating cards, um, almost. Deception dealing with a lot of difficult people, a lot of backstabbing people. So just watch out. And also that legal situation, there was a lot of lies that were spoken uh, in order for that person to get away with it. They're getting away with something. There's an oppression card over here. You are standing up against these people, but it seems like they've taken a lot of advantage of you. You had been carrying a lot of burdens and you were dealing with a lot of problems, a lot of drama. And then there's that tower moment with a lot of loss, a big change in the situation. Um, you know, uh, it seems like your world has been upside down. Some information has come to light, uh, but it's caused a lot of chaos and a lot of drama. So you are trying to look for that truth. Um, you, you're trying to bring some peace back. You're trying to overcome whatever the situation is. And you are trying to get control back of that situation again so and you're also trying to maybe uh, you know get back your financial uh, independence as well with that uh, eight of pentacles so whatever's happened has been quite devastating it's a big uh, dramatic situation this has fallen out of the deck the two of summer let's see okay so with the Two of Summer, it's, it's a pretty good card. You are going to get that help and assistance. There's forgiveness and resolution of a problem, so don't give up. Uh, this re uh, relationship can be healed. So it looks like somebody's going to be coming in to help you, and it looks like uh, they will. this problem will sort itself out. It says don't give up you will be successful. You've got the Six of Summer as well, which says the return of people uh, from your past, remembering events differently in a better light than how they are have occurred. With the Six of Summer, it's also about a good offer coming in. It's an offer of support coming in for you. Um, and it looks like, um, you know, there might be somebody from the past that comes in to give you that support that you need in this very, very difficult circumstance that you're going through. 
You've got the Eight of Autumn, which is just like the Eight of Pentacles, which says do more research before proceeding. Uh, there's education in the form of seminars, going back to school or apprenticeships, excellent craftsmanship or long-term projects. Now, you may have to take all the focus off from, a, from all this legal battle that you're going through and focus on your work again. And this looks like, uh, you know, you get support on the work front and there might be more money coming in, especially with this Eight of um, Autumn, which is like the Eight of Pentacles. Uh, Whatever is going on as far as your work goes, you know, you are learning a lot. You are focused on that and you're working very, very hard uh, to rope in that money as well. You're very, very skilled at what you do. So this could be a battle that you're going through, uh, you know, in your work front. This could also be uh, something that you have to just uh, let go of whatever this legal issue that is that you're going through. Um, there is some forgiveness that is going to be necessary. You need to get some kind of advice, uh, take a little bit of a break, um, you know, and accept a truce if it's being called at this particular moment in order for you to gather your strength uh, and move forward. And uh, you have to re-strategize, come up with a new plan. Uh, you are going through that tower moment where everything is upside down at the moment and, you know, you might be having strong struggling at the moment to find clarity you need to rebalance yourself you know look at your finances again uh, make sure that you have um, uh, you know prioritize decide which what, what is important and where you want to invest your time and your effort in it and you know um, you know change your focus because you have gone through a lot of loss these are just really not very very um, these cards are really uh, showing situations that are pretty bad. There is that new offer coming in and there is going to be support for you. So you will be able to conquer this. Just have faith that you will be able to get through this particular situation. So uh, going through a very, very difficult time. And, um, you know, I wish you all the best of luck. Um, and I hope you get out of it. Thank you so much for watching. And I hope this reading resonates with you. Take care now. Goodbye.